most people don't look at a community's fire protection and say, oh, this is a great place to live. I'm, they got a good fire department. I'm going to move to the community. People move to the community for the other amenities, the bike trails, the parks and rec programs, the city as a whole, school districts, and that sort of thing. So as a fire service, we understand people don't generally think, well, what's the fire department like? Most people assume that the fire department is adequate to meet the needs that the community has. I can tell you all day long we have a great fire department. That's coming from the fire chief, and most fire chiefs are going to tell you they have a great fire department. Uh, accredited departments have the ability to say, we know that our department's really good. And it's not about being an end pursuit. It's about continuous improvement. So just because we reach accreditation next year, which is the goal, we immediately start preparing for the next five years of reaccreditation and that we'll have annual performance appraisals we'll have to do. We'll have uh, annual evaluations of how we're doing things and what we can do to make things better. So it's a continuous pursuit of being better. Most departments are not accredited. Accredited still, uh, there's a small number of departments. I think there are six departments, fire departments in the state that are accredited. So it's a relatively small number in the state. Nationwide's the same thing. I think there's only 1,300 or so departments that are accredited nationwide. Still today, it's, it's, it's a tremendous amount of work, and most people don't. They, they would like to have that accreditation, but they're not prepared to do all the effort that it takes to, to get there. The fire department of Urbandale is dedicated to providing exceptional emergency services and safeguarding the lives and property of our residents. We take great pride in our commitment to excellence and our relentless pursuit of innovation and professionalism.